and I just saw your garden and it made me feel joyful. So is that what you plan to do? Well, I think that is the whole point. We're living in this sheltered environment with everybody who's surrounding this, this planted up area uh, is looking out onto it. It just helps to lift the spirits when you're stuck inside on your own. And I think that is the whole point about an area like this, the flowers, the planting, helps to bring a bit of, of, of life and spirit to everybody who's, who's living here. So basically we've had colour out in the middle the whole way through from the middle of uh, March when you came, in fact it started earlier than that with the snowdrops but then obviously through the crocuses uh, into daffodils with a, you know, a nice display of different daffodils throughout probably nearly getting on for two months ending up with pheasant's eye, a snake's head for tillery, primroses, bluebells, wild garlic and then we've got into the wild meadow which has started to seed and come through and we're hoping to scythe as the year progresses and we'll scythe in stages so that uh, we can keep different insect species and not, not uh, wipe them all out in one, one big mass mowing. I'm obviously sitting here in my wheelchair, I'm paralysed, but it makes you forget so many of the, the problems of everyday life when you can open your curtains or you come out in the morning and you look at this, it, it, it puts you in a you know, much better frame of mind to, to face the day. I can't get anywhere and if I walk along the edge of it I can look at it I can t see which new flowers have come up and it's it's been absolutely wonderful and because I can't do my back garden it's given me an incentive to make a small garden around my front door so it's just been an inspiration it's been brilliant for me because I've been Oh, I've literally been boxed in and um, depressed, but it's just made me feel so good. And it's also an inspiration to know the insects and the butterflies and the bees and everything, you know, are, are, are coming around. It's getting better each year. I mean, there's more flowers coming up that have held this year than there were last year. But yeah, I think it's, it's wonderful. Everybody's saying, don't cut the verges. And it just seems a good example. To other housing estates, you know, that this could be a way that you enhance, you know, what is quite a, a rigid format and things like that. Yeah, no, I think it works. And I have a few out there, the trees. And the more nature, the better, as far as I'm concerned. So I'm, I'm glad that it's lifting other people's spirits, because it certainly does mine.